what does this mean for Yahoo's overall strategy? Well, you can see Deirdre from, from Marissa Meyer demoing the product. She is the product person, and she has known that even though Yahoo is a site that people around the world still visit in big numbers, that it is a stale product compared to what people like to go to first when they're going online or checking their phones these days, whether it's Facebook or Twitter, even something like Pinterest. So in a lot of ways, this is less about the look of the new Yahoo homepage and what it connects to. You mentioned Facebook, the fact that you can uh, link uh, your Facebook account to Yahoo so Yahoo will know what you're talking about on Facebook and then send you the appropriate stories. I think that's Yahoo's way of moving into the into the new century. I mean, when Yahoo was born, in a lot of ways, it was a directory to the internet and trying to find you the best ways. Today, since so much of the internet is social, uh, obviously they can have even better tabs on what you're doing, and I think that's what this is all about. And John, if you're a company such as Google, what do you do in response, if anything? You know, what's interesting is that, yeah, you would think that Google would try to potentially uh, do something similar, and there are, you know, some similarities to what they're doing. The biggest difference with a company like Google is that they have Google Plus, uh, and Google Plus is a rival product to Twitter and to Facebook, and so Yahoo's advantage right now might be that having Facebook as a partner and being able to tap into what people are doing on Facebook so that you can make your product better is something that Facebook is probably okay with. Facebook maybe not okay with that so long as there's a Google Plus product out there for sure. And John, is there any kind of change or organizational change with aggregation here? There has to be. Well, uh, yeah, absolutely. I mean, you would think about what goes into making a product like this. Is it easy to basically just link to Facebook? You need some pretty hardcore um, data analytics tools to make this a strong product. I think the biggest question for Yahoo, Deirdre, is ultimately going to be how many people are going to check this out? You know, you think of a store that has wonderful products and isn't good at getting the message out about all those products so people come into the store. Yahoo, from the start of Marissa Meyer taking over as CEO, has made it a priority to improve the product experience, and, and she has to, and she gets check marks for doing that. The challenge is getting people to come to the site on a regular basis. That's probably the next step in, in this new uh, makeover process.